a YouTube search, you'll find a, a lot of videos on this subject. I'm bringing you a video today on the USS Texas battleship, New York class battleship, uh, last of the dreadnoughts. It's the only battleship that still survives that served in both world wars. Had a crew of 954 and currently is berthed at San Jacinto, Texas as a museum piece. It is currently going under or going through whole restoration because uh, it needs some major work done. They're trying to get it to dry dock. I believe the dry dock they're taking it to is in Mississippi. That's the closest, largest dry dock to be able to dry dock a, a battleship. There are some concerns that uh, repairs may not be sufficient to get it to dry dock and it, it may be lost in the trip getting there. Uh, everybody hands on deck to make sure that doesn't happen. But uh, once it's in dry dock and repairs are made, it's, I uh, believe, bound for Galveston, Texas, where it'll get more tourism and and uh, be more out into the public where people can see it better. It's a grand old ship. It's a gigantic ship. If you've never been to the Texas, you really need to go. When it was launched in 1912, it was the most powerful weapon on the face of the planet. It served in, like I said, both world wars and a lot of major campaigns and, and did its duty and now stands there proudly for all to see. If you ever get by San Jacinto, Texas or if it's moved to Galveston, Texas, or if you're lucky enough to see it in dry dock, wherever that may wind up being, uh, you'll definitely want to take some pictures of it. And once you can, you'll definitely want to tour it. I'm going to actually, I'm going to call this video USS Texas, USS Battleship Texas, then and now. I'm going to have pictures in there of uh, when it served back in World War I, when it served back in World War II, and uh, drone video of it currently. I hope you enjoy the video. Give me a like, thumbs up, and hey, got nothing better to do, you might as well subscribe.
a jeep, a drone, and an old man. We'll be seeing you next time.